The shooting of an unarmed man in Philadelphia is raising new questions about police conduct. Mola Lenghi reports it happened Monday night and was captured on video, a warning. Some of that video is graphic. This surveillance video obtained by our CBS station in Philadelphia is dark and grainy, but you can make out Joel Johnson panhandling Monday evening between slow moving traffic, just as the 28 year old with special needs approached an unmarked police car with his arms outstretched. Four shots were fired from inside, shattering the closed window and sending Johnson stumbling to the ground hit once in the torso. He approached the uh, driver's side of the vehicle and the detective believed what he saw was a firearm in this man, male's hands. The detective believing that he was going to be the robbed or something was going to happen to him produced his firearm. Most don't know him by name, but nearly everyone we spoke to who lives and works in this neighborhood knows of Johnson. They've seen him walking up and down this street asking for quarters. Exactly what he appears to have been doing when he was shot. Hector Torado is his brother. He never walks with any weapons. You won't find a weapon on him. You won't find nothing on him but change. That's it. A preliminary police investigation has not turned up any weapons. Neighbors say Johnson was harmless. He shot an innocent man because he was begging for a quarter. Did this look like a gun to you? Did this look like a gun to you? Look, this is a quarter, man. 29-year-old Philadelphia detective Francis DiGiorgio is on desk duty while an internal affairs investigation is conducted. Meanwhile, Johnson is in critical but stable condition, Major. Mola Lenghi, thanks so much.